Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome again to GOA Fish Farm. I'm back again with another video. Uh, if you are new to this channel, make sure you click on that subscribe button, comment, like, and leave any question for us at the comment section. Now, today I'll be answering your question, which is bottom on which fish is the best fish for you to rear. You know, we have different type of fish breeds. You have different, you have clarias, you have uh, you have hybrid. And among the clarias also, you have the garibantus, you have heterobranchus, you have uh, uh, bidocysis, you have batracus, you have uh, nigricans, and so more and so forth. So, but a lot of fish farmers are confused. That should I go for clarias or hybrid? Don't worry, in this video, I'll be explaining to you the best fish among those two and when to use clarias, when to use hybrid. I'll be explaining the advantages of clarias, the advantages of hybrid. I'll be explaining to you the risk involved in rearing clarias and the risk involved in rearing hybrid. So, if you are new to this channel once again, make sure you click on that subscribe button. And after this session, if you have any question, you can leave it for us. And don't forget, at GOA Farm, we can supply you your clarias and your ivory. Everything you need is just at the back of your call. Just give us a call on 0067-70665 or visit our website at www.goa-farms.com and you, leave any, you can make any of your requests. Now, back to the main video. What is clarias? Clarias is actually a species of fish. And clarias is generally known as an African catfish. It's an, a species of African catfish that is popular or well known in Africa, be it Nigeria or any of the African countries. But hybrid, hybrid is simply a mixture of Clarias breed, different type of clarias breed, that is the uh, 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 clarias, you have heterobranchus, you have the bidocysis. So let's say I bring the heterobranchus, I use the the, 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 the meat to, uh, to mix that of the eggs of uh, the uh, brew stock of a female clarias. The production or the product I will get from such is going to be an hybrid. Now, is it hybrid is hybrid bad? Is it better than clarias? Now, Clarias is very good. Also, hybrid is very good. However, the advantage of hybrid is that hybrid are more immune than Clarias. Listen, they are more stronger than Clarias. That is the, the rate of mortality that you might experience in uh, hybrid is lower compared to that of the uh, compared to that of the Clarias because they are very strong and rugged. However, this being number one, you have to know that hybrid, they grow at the rate of five months to seven months. That is their uh, 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 rapid growth age. So if you are rearing, if you want to rear hybrid now, you must be somebody who is ready to have this production for about seven months. That is, you will feed them, they won't really, they will be growing, but their growth will, that will be productive will come from the fifth month to the seventh month. So if you are somebody who wants to have a three-quarter production in a year, it is not advisable you go for hybrid. Because if you rear hybrid for just three to four months and you sell, they can be weighing very well as a kg per one or one point something kg per one within four months. No, because you have rapid growth and weight start from the age of fourth month to seventh month. So if you want to go for hybrid, you must be ready to have say seven months production or six months minimum also if you want to have your hybrid you should know that you must have an, a, a, a suitable water you must have access to water because your water must be available and your feet so you have to have your water available change constant changing of water you must have adequate feed because they they, they are super active so you must have enough feed for your fish if you are intending to have hybrid so these are the advantages of hybrid and anyone that wants to go into hybrid you must put these factors into consideration the experience has shown however that clarias is good and is very well recommended for farmers who want to have three quarter production that is for four months production if you feed your clarias very well within four months each of them will be weighing 1.5 kg 
if you feed them very well. Like I do tell people, it's not a matter of how many fish do you have in your pond. Experience has shown, even I personally, by the time I stock and I run out of feed, I end up running at loss for that period because I won't be able to reach to a standard that is expected. And if you do not feed your fish well, they won't, they won't weigh much. I know our sale is upon weight. That is what is the kg of your fish, which is going to uh, uh, determine the amount that you should be selling. Like somebody who called me from Ogun State uh, 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 this week, he was telling me about his experience, what people told him about clarias, that clarias do die. And look, let me tell you for a fact, any fish, be it clarias or hybrid, can die. You can experience any mortality at high rate or at minimal rate. It depends on how you manage your fish, the experience you have. Yes, hybrid are more stronger, they are more rugged. It's just like a, a like Yoruba will say, they will say we have a omon pako, omon boti. You know, both of them are Nigerians, but then you come from somebody who is well uh, fed, who is growing up, the rate at which is going to grow compared to a locally uh, breed that he hardly eat, he hardly so that is just the difference. So if you do not treat them very well, for example, if a rich kid should get malaria and is not well treated for that malaria, definitely he might uh, have severe uh, illness. Even likewise, somebody who is not who is a, who is poor from a poor background, if person is sick and is not treating himself very well, definitely he might end up having more severe sickness or even leading to death. So your fish, if you stress them, be it hybrid or clarias, they will die. If you let's say after feeding them, you immediately you started changing water. As well, if you are using tarpaulin or concrete pond, you feed them your fish about an hour. You started changing the water. It will lead to stress, which can lead to death. If you overfeed them, this will lead to death. So these are things that lead to mortality. It's not in relation whether it is hybrid or or or, or clarias. But like I said earlier, hybrid are a little bit stronger compared to. Clarias. So, if you want to go for clarias now, if you intend to have your production for four months, it is advisable you go for clarias. Feed them for that four months, sell, and you will make maximum profit. But if you want to go for hybrid, please make sure you are ready for seven months production. If you rear hybrid for four months, you'll be running at loss because they won't weigh much at that four months. So, and also for your clarias, don't let anybody uh, uh, poison your mind. Clarias are very good. If you rear them very well, also uh, 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 hybrid are very good. If you rear them very well, so you have to look at the factors that you have that have listed around. Do you intend having your production for four months or seven months? This will determine whether you should go for hybrid or clarias. If do you have adequate water supply and do you have adequate feed? For both, they need water, good adequate water supply, and they need adequate feed. So whether you go for hybrid, whether you go for clarias. Just follow the rules of rearing of catfish, be it the uh, uh, be it the, the clarias or hybrid. That is maintenance of water, uh, 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 maintenance of the temperature, feeding, and uh, 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 use of other available resources for your fish. So you can see now that uh, I believe with this video, I'll be able to clear your doubts as regards to some people who because I've gotten different calls even in the last interview session I attended to in Portaco, they asked me about the importance of hybrid and many farmers are like they are running away from clarias. Clarias is very good, just that you need to follow the principle, the rules of rearing them. Hybrid too are very good, but hybrid it's not good for somebody who wants to have a four month production. You have to be a production for seven months. That is when you can have your uh, a high profit. Experience has shown this. So if you really want to go for hybrid, be ready for seven month production. If you want to go for clarier, be ready for at least three to four month production and you'll be having your profit. All right. So this is the uh, 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 pro production for this video. If you are new to this channel, make sure you click on that subscribe button, comment, like, and leave any question for us at the comment section. So if you have any, if you have any question or if a part in fish farming you want us to make a video for you, just drop it at the comment section. I will surely do a video. On to the next video. Stay blessed.